The SMS is a seven by eight foot module, which is suspended by a long cable beneath the helicopter, which transports it to and from the scene of a disaster. The module has its own self-contained propulsion and control system that is powered by a 210 horsepower conventional aircraft engine, which drives a nine bladed 36 inch diameter fan. This fan delivers air to controllable nozzles at each of the four corners of the stabilization platform. It is this unique nozzle system which allows the SMS onboard operator to maneuver to a precise location while enabling the supporting helicopter to remain in a safe position away from the hostile environment. When suspended by a 1,000 foot cable, this system enables the unit to maneuver a distance of 160 feet horizontally from beneath the hovering helicopter. Following a precise route, the helicopter maneuvered the SMS between 15 and 20 story buildings to arrive on the simulated fire scene within five minutes of takeoff. The SMS quickly docked two floors beneath the location of the fire and firemen transferred to the structure to connect the two and one half inch hose to a standpipe. The unit then backed off to begin an exterior water attack of the simulated fire area. To minimize the potential for glass breakage, a fog nozzle was employed in this demonstration, rather than the straight stream nozzle that normally would be employed. A point to keep in mind is that the type of helicopter used had never been employed in any previous SMS test or demonstration, and that the helicopter crew that flew this mission had less than two hours of training time with the SMS. Their first experience with a high-rise docking was during the demonstration at the Aladdin Hotel. The SMS then maneuvered to a corner apartment where other victims had been trapped. They were quickly transferred to the SMS. While the module was on the ground, these helicopter crewmen on their first SMS mission were able to maintain a close vertical control with no slack in the 1,000-foot cable. Uh -huh. 